Welcome to another episode of Fish in the Little West. This is probably one of the coldest times I've ever fished here in Central Ohio. It is early winter, November 30th, and I'm doing my very last MTB Pro Slam of the season. This is it, man. I'm going to be fishing with a 24-inch rod here in a little bit. But I decided to end this year on a bang with the MTB Pro Slam. This may be my last open water video here in the Midwest. Regardless, I may do some fishing down in the south. But that's a whole other story. I also didn't do an unboxing of this box, so I'm going to do it right now, real quick. Um, I mean, really quick, so I can get out in the water and hopefully find out what these fish are doing. I have no idea. The water temp's like 46 degrees right now. It's ridiculous. Without further ado, let's see what's inside. There's one. Finally, dude. I don't know how big it is, but it's a fish. I just hit some rocks and he was on. I don't think it's that big. I could be wrong though. No, don't come off, don't come off. Please don't, I gotta get him out of that anchor. Dude, please don't come off. God, he barely hit it. He barely hit it. Oh, man. oh my God. Get over here. Get over here. Yes. Ooh. Not a giant. Not a giant. But I will take it with how hard the bite is. The water temp's like 47 degrees right now. I will take that all day. All right. She's going in the well. Like first cast on that crankbait. I just reeled down a few times and hit like one rock and he was just on there. That was awesome. Whew. I'm stoked, dude. I was really worried I was going to get skunked. I wish he was a little bit bigger, though. That's fine. Oh, I'm not complaining at all. Any bite I can get today is, is, is going to be good. Okay. All right, so we're going to call this halftime right now. It's almost one. It's five till. And I'm going to head in, eat, charge the Tron motor battery, all my camera batteries, find my camera batteries. I don't know what how I'm like missing three of my batteries. I'm going to fish basically until it gets dark. And then once it gets dark, i got to get packed up and head back uh, from central Ohio to southeastern Ohio where I go to school. So crazy, crazy day. Hopefully I can finish the slam on a good note. Of course, I won't be able to catch fish on all the lures, but hopefully I can catch some toads. This time of year can be a pretty decent time to catch some giants. All righty. Come on. All right, set this anchor over. All right. Good to go. Time to get the battery and get that stinky little fish out of there and get them measured. Alright. Let's see this dude. He's a pretty decent fish, actually. Okie dokie. There's the nose. Pinch it. He's at 16 inches. Not a bad little fish. Put him in there, get some pictures, and drop him back in. That's nice. Hey! Is dinner ready, Lily? Is dinner ready? Sounds good. <laughs> Got one. One? Yeah, one little bass. I'm about to catch her though. Hey, you shut your mouth. Wow, looks really good. Yeah. Woo! That's the meat. Lunch was good, now it's time to head back on the lake. All right, back out in the lake. Gonna start off with the jerk bait. 
the wind has calmed down significantly and it's warmed up a lot. Unfortunately, the day is kind of coming to a near end and uh, overcast is still here, so whatever. <laughs> Oh, it came off! No! No, it's not. Oh, I worked so hard for that jerk big bike. Dude, I cannot believe this. My camera just turned off and I got a little fish on the drop shot. I don't know, you guys can count this if you want, but I'm so mad. Dude, I got bit and I was like, it's on, man, I got one. I'm gonna get a measurement on this dude then get back on this little dock. I caught that dude on the, uh, that came off the BioVex Colt Shad Tail. So that's that. Can't believe that. I hope I got maybe at least a part of the catch. <sighs> Bogus. All right, I think that's it. It's getting too dark. And I have about a two hour drive back to school. I gave it my all. All right, let's get a measurement on Stanley. There's Stanley. He's kind of a dink, but whatever. Okay, that water is so cold. By the way, it's like negative 20 degrees. Okay, you know what? I really don't want to do this. I'm guessing you're, uh, let's say 13. There's the nose. Pinch it. Just short of 14. Thanks, Stanley. Really appreciate it. I'll put you right back by, down by the dam. Take care, buddy. See ya. Oh, man, that's cold. Okay, so that's that. I had two fish for an accumulative of maybe, like, two and three quarters, three pounds, something like that, nothing impressive, but I must say that is the most fish I've caught in one day this entire trip. I've caught like one fish each day. Um, it's probably my smallest weight. I've been catching some pretty decent fish. I guess that's a little bit of a progression. The cool thing I do like about these MTV slams is it kind of forces me to fish a certain way. So I'm not like going through all my stuff and looking for that one bait that works. So did have fun today. You know, it was uh, kind of a learning experience. Also, I think I'm completely sick and tired of uh, winter already even though it hasn't frozen over yet so um see you guys back at hawking college all right just made it back it is 8 20 i'm super wiped had a fun time doing that mtb slam if you guys have any questions about the actual mtb slam in of itself i'll leave all of your answers in the description below or just shoot me a comment all right i think that's about it folks i am wiped see you later